Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we have an unboxing. I'm so excited. Um, so this is a Tory Burch item and I don't have anything Tory Burch, so I'm really excited. Um, and once I unbox it, I will explain to you why I got it. So if that's something you're interested in seeing, keep on watching. Okay, let's get into the unboxing. Okay, so when you open it, it has this cute little card. Oops. It just has this cute little card, like a thank you card from Tory Burch. And then you open it, and the little purchase is right in here. Wrapped all nice. Okay, so this little item here is called the Tory Burch Robinson Card Case Key Fob in Black. And I believed it was like $98 maybe. So let me open this. That's just like a protective. Oh my God, it's so cute. Okay, so this is what it looks like. It has a little keychain. Has a little back pocket right here. Has a zip compartment. It's a little stiff. There's a little, and then it has a little button piece right here that you can also put stuff in. Okay. So I've been looking for a little keychain pouch like this for quite a while and I didn't want to spend a ton of money on one because I have, I know it's not a key pouch, but I have my mini pochette, which I feel like I'm ruining because I bring it everywhere with me all the time. So I feel like I am ruining my mini pochette, even though I know I'm not, like it's just normal wear and tear, but this little strap thing here is just like messed up and gross. And then on the zipper and hardware, it's tarnishing a little bit. And I've only had this for like two years. So I wanna keep it like in good condition for as long as I can. So I figured I could use this for my wallet and my keys, basically what my mini pochette does, just not my mini pochette. And then I could put lipsticks and stuff in that. So I want to see what fits. Um, this, the metal doesn't feel like as nice as like the Louis Vuitton one. It feels like almost like plastic with like a coating on it. It very well could be. Um, but the zipper goes nice. So let's see what I can fit in. So basically I got it to replace my little key pouch right here because my key pouch goes in here and then like I could still have this be a catch-all though but this way I could just take this and throw it in my bag when I have to go anywhere also I wonder if this will fit in my pull-in bag it probably will I will test that so I'm gonna get some of my cards out I don't know I feel like my cards I would want to put in the zipper part just so they don't fall out that was another thing that I was looking for um, where it has a zipper compartment so I can just not worry about any cards falling out I probably wouldn't like keep a card back here like this just my preference I mean maybe if it was in my purse I would but just on an everyday basis I wouldn't do that so I have my two main cards and my ID in there. I keep my cards in a very particular spot. I think it's just, I'll have to get used to it. But it is a little tight. Um, I have a bunch of cards in there right now. I have like some credit cards and then I have some, I think these are like my dental cards, stuff like that. Um, let's see. I don't really keep change on me. 
if I do, it's just in my car. Um, and then I just grabbed some cash. I grabbed three bills. Which you can fit that right in there. Right here. Or you could fit it in the back probably. Doesn't look as nice in the back, but it fits. One thing that I always need to keep with me is chapstick whenever I go anywhere. I don't care where I'm going. I need chapstick, which I always, I just have Blistex. Let's see if that even fits. It probably won't. It does fit in zipper, but I don't know. It'll definitely be a challenge to unzip. Hmm. I don't know if it'll fit in here. Probably not. Yeah. It doesn't fit in that front piece either. Um, okay, and so then I would attach my keys. Which I don't know if I should I'll attach them because I just don't know if I'm gonna keep this or not. But like this was my whole idea. I could just grab this and go. Which, I mean, it works. It's just I, I would need to find a spot to keep my, my chapstick. I don't know. We'll see. I might keep it. I might not. Um, I am going to go get my pull-in bag real quick to see how it fits in there. Okay, so I grabbed my pull-in bag. This was one of like the main reasons I needed like a smaller little wallet. And that fits obviously no problem. And it doesn't, it's not nearly as big as the mini pochette, so it fits. This is like a side-by-side -side comparison. Um, obviously, the mini pochette is a lot bigger. I wasn't going for, like, duping this or anything. I just wanted something where I could just throw it in my work bag and not worry if it, like, gets damaged at all. Um, but, yeah, so I'm going to go, let me up what this is made out of so i pulled up the information on this this is um safiano leather so it's going to be really durable um i wonder because it is leather i know safiano leather is kind of like like really durable but i wonder if this is going to stretch out at all because if this did stretch out like a little bit i would be a hundred percent on it um it is so cute the quality looks amazing I mean, looks really nice. Um, like I said, it can fit like, I could probably fit a couple more cards in here. I don't necessarily need all these cards. I just like to keep extra cards just on me in case, but I'd, I'd have to, cause like I use my Target and my debit card the most. So I could maybe try to figure out, I wonder if they would fit in the front pocket. Cause like I never use my drivers, my driver's license unless like it's for one second. I could do that actually. So my bank card and my target card could fit right in the front and, and it's secure. That's what I want. I want it to be secure. So I could do that and then I could just, you know, I could just pop it open, grab the card I need. Like I said, it's a little stiff, but if I needed my debit card or my red card, be right in there. And then all the other cards that I need and carry with me on a daily basis can go in here and then some cash. I don't usually carry cash, but um, just for the sake of this video, I figured I would do a little cash in there. My only thing is the chapstick. I mean, I, I probably have one in my work bag and that's the only time I wouldn't have a chapstick on me, but you know, I'm a creature of habit, so I like things the way I like them. So it will be an adjustment changing from this um, to this. So if I do end up keeping this, I will do like another video on it, how it wears and if it stretches out at all. Um, not that I want like leather to stretch out, but I think for like usability, it would be a lot better if it did just, just a tiny bit, just soften a little bit. It is adorable and I will let you know if I end up keeping it or not. So that is my unboxing of my little Tory Burch key pouch. 
If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe, and I will see you in my next video. Bye!